Well, the, the thing that I've, because I have struggled, uh, I, I struggled for uh, quite a while to get to sleep. And for me, it, it's never been a case of staying asleep has been the problem, but it's it's getting to sleep in the first place that's always been the issue with me. And I've, I've kind of, I feel like I've, I've come to a point where I've overcome a lot of that. And in relation to what you just said about the sort of late night stimulation of like Netflix or your phone or something, I noticed that the one thing that really started to move the needle was the was was this probably one of the simplest things you could do which is to have a bit of time even if it's just half an hour where you just you are completely unstimulated you have no external stimulation yeah. and it was really weird because i just i'll just i'll just sit there like a like a cat hmm. you know i won't be i won't be entertained by anything i'll just sort of sit there and just be in my own space for a bit and just look around the room and just like like i'll not be I'll not have something that's that's taking my attention away because I'll notice it's so ridiculous, and I'd, I'd often sort of, um, you know, be like, "Woe is me at the universe" because I didn't sleep well. But it's mm -hmm. like if I think about it, what actually what I was doing was I'd be just constantly stimulated, right up until the point where I'd just turn my phone off in bed, put it on the bedside cabinet, and then just try and sleep and be like, "Oh, for God's sake, I can't sleep. <laughs> God, it's such an injustice." It's like, look. What chance does your body have of switching off just because you decide it's convenient? Mm -hmm. It's like you've just been stimulating your body for the past four hours using Netflix or Facebook or Instagram or whatever, or YouTube, and you expect your body to switch off because you want it to. It's like, no, you've just been training your body to just be perceiving things and be stimulated and to be interpreting information and stuff. It's like your brain won't switch off at that point. Yeah, yeah. So you've got, to give your, you've got to give your brain a chance to just slow down a little bit. Yeah, it is. It is funny. Exactly. We, <laughs> I, I had that too for for a long time. Where, yeah, I struggled to fall asleep, but often it was exactly like that. It's like, what do you expect would happen? Like, 